All right, so we're back again. Another video. Today is Sunday. The high temps of uh, today are going to reach 50. It's a little windy today, so I got the anchor along with me. And uh, water temp is currently 43.5. Water temp's going up a little bit, which is good. Maybe we got some fish activity moving in later in this afternoon. We'll see what we can do. So we're just going to actually row right down to the spots that we got them at last time and uh, see what we could do. We'll see you in a few minutes. Yeah, a little better. If you open your mouth. Yeah, the hook went in one way and then in another way, and then it like twisted, and I don't think he was coming off anytime soon. No. Yeah, not bad. Oh, I got a lot of salt today. I think my grub is pretty pretty dead though. I need to. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good. That's another twelve. Actually, you know what? I'll take those all day long. You got it all on? Yeah. Yo, we, we, we got like... Sometimes they... Oh, this is a good one. He came right out. Look at that thing boiling out there. Huh? Look at that thing. There's two more following him. Huh? There's two more following him. Oh, there was two following him? Yeah. The wind helps too. I, I guess the wind helps push the bait around, whatever they're eating. Oh, it does. Not a bad fish though. Right? Oh, you know what? I mean, every one of these fish, Joe. We haven't caught. And you know what's funny? We're not catching ones that are six inches. No, no, they're, they're, they're all. I think I think they grow. I think they grow so fast in this lake. Like there's so much food for them. Yeah, where are you at? Oh, I'm right here. Oh? Yeah. They were there more to the right. That one. Yeah, I'm not kind of like casting towards the bulkhead there. Yeah. Not, not casting towards those uh, those stalks or whatever. But these are these seem like they're more juvenile fish. Like some of them, you know, like yeah. these are like you know between ten and ten and eleven inches. This is, yeah, so this is the uh, Actually, no, they're bigger than this. This all I was catching before. Oh yeah. It was like one after another. I was like, I got every lake over here. Yeah. But these these fish in these schools are not they're not very big. Like these are no. these are nothing compared to the ones I was getting like like nothing compared. No, uh, would you, you know what those, that's all right. It is all right. It's fine because you know what? If there's that good a population of them, they're gonna grow. There's plenty of food for them. You know. Thank God for the anchor today. There you go. 
purple ones right under the boat here. All about the same size. 10 inches. All right, stop flopping around. All right, stop it. Stop your shenanigans. I'm gonna smack you in the head. Yeah. Herring. This is the first. This is the first herring I actually saw this year. Look at this. I, thing. I, I've caught them. Look at this. Woo! Here we go. <laughs> now I gotta wash my hands. Another herring. Oh, perch. Perchy. Perchy. Can you believe that? That's why they're down here in the corner. They're eating the herring. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, they're crappy. That's why the crappy gets so big in here. They're the, probably eating <laughs> the herring. I bet you when we find them off of uh, Hannenberg's pipe there, yeah. they're probably eating the schools of herring that are up. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. I'll put money on that. I'll put the stuff that's going on. Yeah. All right. Oh, boy. All right, Joe. Come on. Take four more. Ah, going inside. All right. Cold. So, update. I had my buddy Eric, he just left. He fished with me for about an hour. We caught about, uh, between perch and crappie, we caught about 70 fish in an hour. So uh, it seemed like these fish were all stacked down in the corner here. And actually by accident, we caught a couple of herring or thrift and shad on the jigs we were using. There was a ton of bait that blew up into this cove down here. I don't even know how many crappie and perch were down there. Could have been hundreds, thousands maybe. I'm gonna see if I can get back up to this tree where I got the bigger crappie last week. They didn't appear to be here before. So I'm not sure if they kind of just moved back and forth throughout the day. <laughs> so we'll see what happens. Okay. These, the school of these fish is just just average fish, you know. Well, this one's about twelve, you know. You ate that thing. Pliers there. All I'm doing is I'm casting this thing out, this jig, and this uh, little swim bait, and I'm just barely, I'm just reeling it nice and slow. And once I feel a bump, I got him. It's a perch, my first perch of the day. First perch of the day, hopefully it's my last of the day. I'd rather catch the crappy than the perch, unless the perch are really big, but this is just small. Yeah, another perch? Oh, that's a crappy, I see that. Bite, or just wait. Now that the wind is dying, I'm wondering if these fish are going to move locations. Because this bait, all this bait was getting pushed into the 
was getting pushed into the cove down here, and now that the wind is dying, uh, that bait is going to move. Bet you. Decent one. There we go, he ate it. He ate it. Pretty far down there. Okay, here we go. Right now. Yeah. By the time I get back and put all my stuff away, it'll be like five o'clock. So. Oh, yeah. All right. No, let's see what is happening. Yeah. No, there's they're still here. They didn't they didn't really uh, go anywhere. I mean, I could probably sit here all night and catch them, but I'm not. I'm probably leaving in like a half hour. Gotcha. Yeah. I'll, I'll call you before I leave. I'll let you know if I hit anything good. All right. Buddy. All right talk Bye. to you in a bit. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Coming out now. There, buddy. Like literally, the bigger ones are coming out now. Getting a little bit later in the evening, we're getting a little bit bigger ones here. We were catching all about 10-inch fish the whole day. That's 12-inch. Uh, I think these bigger fish are coming up now. I think these bigger ones are coming up to play because it's getting a little bit darker. Yes, uh... All right, open your mouth. This is probably the best one of the day, if I can get them in the boat here. All right, I'm gonna carefully lift them up because he's pretty, he's pretty big. Yeah, come here. Decent. Fat female. Hooked pretty good here. Alright. There we go. Alright. Good one. Put that one back. fish here. You know, I could sit here all night and catch them, but the average fish is turning into like, you know, 10 inches. So I think I'm going to head back up to another point up there, give it like 15 minutes, and then I'm going to head out of here. So we'll see you in a few minutes, hit the last spot, and then we'll give you an update.